welcome, welcome, my major boredom, and you're watching my Let's Play of Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu on Nintendo Switch. So, in the last episode, we went all the way through the tower until a ghost stopped us. We need some kind of synth scope or something like that. We came out of the tower, we saw Team Rocket, and they're going back to their hideout in Celadon, Cellophane City, whatever. And as that's our only lead, or what the game's hinting us to do, we're gonna we're gonna go there and no doubt battle a million people on the way. And here we go. What a cute round of fluffy Pokemon. Obviously fighting talk around these parts. Alright. Yeah, beauty. Alright, she's got a Kaferi. We are gonna punch it right in the face with our Geo dude. All right, so level 26, so it's actually harder than us. But let's just see what we got. Ah, avoided. Damn. Waggling a finger left. All right, what? No idea what that, that did. <laughs> Literally no idea. Let's do a takedown. We did a bit of damage to ourselves, obviously. But it did some damage to them. Alright. It's leared us up. Our defense is gone down. Let's see if we can do a rock slide this time. Hey, actually hit. Nice. All right, we got a bit of XP for old Geodude. Stop. Don't be so mean to my Clefairy. Well, don't make your Clefairy fight me. Crazy, crazy person. All right, okay. Ooh, looks like we can chop down this tree. Go on, Pikachu. What we got in this tall grass? Nothing that interesting. Other than this ball. Firestone, eh? What's a firestone do? Let's have a look. So that was in our power up pocket. A peculiar stone that makes certain species of Pokemon evolve. Hmm. The stone has a fiery orange heart. Oh, okay. We got an ice one as well. That's incompatible with everyone. But this will probably be compatible with no one also. I thought that might work on Charmeleon, but clearly not. No worries. Alright. Oh, I was going to see if I can catch that Kadabra. We don't care about this Pidgey. Ah, screw it. You know what? Let's see if we can uh, catch it. It was kind of like a red circle, so we probably won't be able to. Let's try again. Got an excellent, so hopefully we can get a bit of XP for our peeps. Oh, yeah. All right, nice one. We caught the Pidgey. Oh, yeah. Ooh, we got some candies as well. All right, we tucked Pidgey away in our pocket. Good old thing. We just chuck it in our pocket. Let's see what its master trainer wants. I can catch a load of Pokemon around here, so buzz off. All right, fighting talk again. All right, they got a Kadabra. <laughs> Geodude's not going to do anything. I don't think. You know what, though? That's... Let's drop her. Let's do a sand attack. Oh, this is going to wreck us, isn't it? Ouch. Ouch, indeed. Okay, we've got a Pikachu. We have a Zippy Zap. Let's see if we can attack first. And... Give this Kadabra a good old slap. Oh, 
That worked. Nice. All right, we got a whole ton of XP. Ooh, some match will, will keep on battling, I think. He is looking hench with his weird red fadey stretch marks. We just want him KO'd, though. All right. Ooh. We avoided. Oh, we got a little bit of a heart then. What was? What did that mean? Hmm. All right, let's do another zippy zap. Oh, not quite finished off. All right, hopefully they won't submit. Oh, no, they're submitting us. Whatever that means. Oh, well, he killed himself. <laughs> what a fool. Pikachu almost went up a level. Trillion's gone up a level. Sweet. We beat her. You didn't buzz off. I got some Ultra Balls. Tidy. I'll tell you what, let's just real quick run back to town and heal up because we want our Geodude to be getting XP. I kind of really like the Lavender Town creepy music. Uh, let's get this done. And I still love that little jingle. All right. Let's run the gauntlet. We're running the gauntlet. What's this old man want to do? I'm a rambling gaming dude. Cool, mate. All right, Gamer Rich. Oh, Sea King. Never seen this one. I don't think Geodude is the right guy for the job. But we know who is. Nice electric Pokemon for the water type. Should wreck them. All right, we missed the horn drill. We avoided it. That's good. Let's use a little thunderbolt. Hopefully, should. Oh, it's super effective. But oh wow, they're like level thirty-five. Damn. No wonder it didn't just finish them off. We must have a ton of health. All right. I know you could do it. Hopefully, GOD will get a ton of XP from. Just been in this fight. Old Peek has gone up a level. Nice. Sweet. Everything's going up quite nicely. Ooh, wants to learn Thunder. Let's see what Thunder does. A wicked Thunderbolt is dropped on the target to inflict damage. This may also leave the target with paralysis. Ooh, it's only got 70 accuracy though. I'm going to forget Thunderbolt and learn Thunder, I think. Let me just... Yeah, 110 power. Yeah, let's forget this. Nice one, Pikachu. Geodude got a whole ton. Oh, yeah, and he went up a level. Sweet. Nice. I just thought, well, everyone's going up. Missed my big chance. Wow, he gave us a ton of money. He looked really pissed, though. <laughs> oh, yeah. All right. It paid off going back to the old Geodude because it looks like we're going to evolve to Graveler. Come yeah, on. Bring it on. Yeah, boy. 
Pretty happy with that. Strangely didn't go up much in weight. Oh yeah! Ivasaur's evolving. Is that Venusaur, maybe? It's all kicking off. All the evolutions. Oh, let's check out the pa palm tree. Oh yeah, we got a Venusaur. Pretty chuffed with that as well. Big old fat <laughs> toad. The flower on its back catches the sun rays. The sunlight is then absorbed and used for energy. Oh yeah. Wants to learn the move petal dance. All right. No idea what this is. The user attacks the target by scattering petals for two to three turns. The user then becomes confused. The user attacks the target by scattering petals for two to three turns. I mean, it does a lot of damage, but if it takes a few turns, that's not so good. Maybe we want to replace takedown. Razor Leaf doesn't do that much damage. Leech Siege is just great. Poison Powder is pretty good. If we get really kind of stuck. Yeah, let's replace takedown, I think. We haven't got any normal moves, which is a little bit concerning. But we can always, like, give them headbutt or something later if we need to with a TM. I mean, we, we can always just not use Venus or if we if we kind of get stuck against someone that's not very good against them. You look good at Pokemon, but how was your chemis chemistry grade? Well, I'm a child, so probably not that great. And also, I'm not in school. I'm just bunking off and running around fighting random people. Super nerd Aiden. Alright, he's got a Coughlin. I know you could do a Graveler. Ooh, right, let's... Let's, let's do a Rock Slide. See what what happens. Yeah, not bad. Flinched, couldn't move. Let's just do another one. See if we can finish him off with that. And that's how you do it. I am pretty good at Pokemon, it seems, according to Aiden. All right, not too much XP, but it's all good. Ow, meltdown. All right, mate. He's pretty upset by that, though. We'll just pick up people's trash. Oh, this dude's got a megaphone. You should be informed. You need strategy to win at this. Really? Or do we just need Zippy's app? Rocker Glen? What makes him a rocker? And why is he not using rock Pokemon? It's alright. Your electricity will do nothing against us. Oh, double kick probably will though. It's super effective. Damn you. That was also pretty good, though. We'll just have another bit of that, I think. Oh, this is one of those attacks that just keeps going. Leave my poor Gravlo alone. Have a bit of that. Yeah, faint. Ooh, got a ton of XP there. Nearly 500.
Kadabra's going up a level. I really need to trade him with someone so I can level him up or evolve him. It's not logical. Oh, mate, he was cheap. He didn't give us much. Didn't even give us a thousand dollars. All right, so we need to get up there somehow. So we can run along and jump down the bit. To get that Pokeball. Hmm. But how do we get up there? I love that the street lights are wind powered. <laughs> oh, okay. It looks like we get there from the left. So we'll probably... I'll be going for a tunnel in a minute, it seems. Alright, let's play a game. Alright, game of X. Game of Stan. Alright, he's got a Rhyhorn. Rhyhorns do look pretty cool. Let's switch out Parabola, though. Wow, Venusaur is got a lot of health now. Let's get our war turtle out. Let's see if we can pull off a uh, a scold. All right, she's in horn drill. Man, it missed. I actually can't remember what bite does. The target is bitten with vicious sharp fangs. Alright, it may cause them to flinch. Okay, but we want to use Scold. Wow, that was super effective. Nice, we got 200 XP, 240 for Graveler. Drat, come up short. Oh, he's got loads of money. 4,000. Not bad. Hmm, looks like we've got a choice of places to go to. See if we can get this ball faster. A big mushroom. Alright, what does the big mushroom do? It's in our bag. Just sitting there. So what do the nuggets do? A nugget of the purest gold that gives a luxurious gleam in direct light. It can be sold at a high price in shops. Alright, we probably should do that then. A very large and rare mushroom is popular with certain class of collectors. A lovely red sand that flows for... Uh, it can be sold at a low price. Do we just... Are these just for selling or do we... Do we keep these? This stuff. I feel like I should keep them for some reason. Hmm. But then, I am a little bit of a hoarder in games, so... Meowth is so cute. Meow, meow, meow. I wonder if I'll be fighting a Meowth. Alright, Andrea. I wonder if they actually run out of names at any point in this game. Alright, Grappler. I know you can do it. You don't have much health, though. <laughs> oh, she has got a lot of Pokemon. Level 25, Meowth. I'm going to switch, though. Because she's got three Pokemon, and I don't want Grabler to get knocked out. Let's see what Venusaur's got. Wow, that did nothing. Let's see what Petal Dance does, then. Wow, it, it wrecks mouths. That's what it does.
Well, we've got another meow. I wonder if the last one is a meow. Meow. Alright, let's get Venusaur out just because they've got tons of health. Uh, tons of XP. Alright, Charmeleon, you ain't done much for a while. You need some XP. Oh yeah. Right, let's set its fur on fire. Damn, Fury Swipes. Actually, let's use our Fury Swipes. Have some back. Yeah, boy. Let me guess, another Meowth? What a shock. What a shock indeed. Break, break his head. Ooh, ooh, ooh. ooh, he didn't like that. He really didn't like that. Meow. Oh, God. So tight. Only $500. So, what are we thinking? Meowths or a dog Pokemon? We're showing off our Pokemon. Do you want to try? Alright, what she got? Oh, she got a Pikachu. No, she only has one. Uh, Graveler could be a good bet then. If Pikachu doesn't kill her in one go. Come on. There we go. Yeah, I do like all those rocks landed on your head. Oh, our Graveler's almost going up a level again. Look what you did to my poor cute Pokemon. Yeah. Give me that cash money. Alright, where's this go? Underground path to Celadon City, which is where we want to go. Oh, it looks like we're finding this guy. I want to know where this goes. School is fun. It's so a Pokemon. Yeah, stay in school, kids. Alright, Leslie. What you got? You got a Magmite. Alright. Probably a good idea to keep Graveler in then. Let's see if we can get the rock slide off. It wasn't super effective. But it did flinch, so that is good. Hmm. Does sand attack do damage? No. Ooh, a takedown though, but I could injure myself. So let's do a rock slide again, see if we can make him flinch again. Oh, nope. Just missed. Alright, let's get him out. Stick a dabber in. I think a side beam can't fix. Come on. Hmm, it's not very effective. It did a fair bit of damage, but yeah, it didn't. Ooh. All right, we need this side beam to kill him first. There we go. It's not really effective, but it was effective in that it did the desired effect, so that's cool. New party. Uh, got some more XP. Sweet. You made it clear to me that I should stick with school. 
you should. All right, where is this going? We know we need the tunnel. Come on, guard duty, and I take my duty very seriously. But gee, I am ever thirsty. Wish I had some tea to drink. Oh, hold on there, kid. I'm afraid I can't let you pass through here. All right, okay, so is that the checkpoint we tried going through before and the guy said he was thirsty? Let's have a look on our map. Which is here. Probably. Uh, we're going to go through the tunnel to here. And see what is up. So, yep. Okay. Well, we'll save that for a future episode. Thanks very much for watching. I made your boredom. Please like this video if you enjoyed me battling a load of chumps. And uh, I'll see you next time. Leave comments below. I made your boredom on Twitter. And please subscribe if you haven't already. It really helps on the channel. Thanks very much. Cheers. Bye.